Hey everybody, it's Emily. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be filming a haul for you. I have this stuff right here, and then I also have another bit that was actually filmed before this, but I introed that one as like a welcome back to another haul bit. Um, and I guess it doesn't really matter, but yeah. Um, I have some scrunchies and then stickers and some overlay tapes, and I'm like really, really excited. So I'm gonna start with the scrunchies um, just to get that stuff out of the way. I do have one that's in my hair right now too, um, so I'm sorry. It's really pretty. I could like take it out, but my hair looks really good right now. It's like a satin purple one. It's really pretty. Um, so this is from Threads by Ty, which if you've watched my hauls before, I have shopped with this shop before. They're on Etsy. I found them through TikTok. The sticker right here is really pretty. And they have a lot of really, really cute, I already used this one, so it's kind of like got dry shampoo on it. But they've got a lot of really cool designs. Excuse me, I just had Taco Bell. And they have horror scrunchies, and I do own all of them now. Um, the first time I did not pick up Jigsaw because I didn't want to be a poser, but I am going to be watching it, so... I picked it up. It's also like a really neutral color, so I'm really excited about that. And then they had a new release of Chucky, and Chucky is one of my favorite, favorite people and favorite movies. Um, and so I picked up two, and I did also pick up these two right here. Not that I would have gotten other ones. Um, no, I did these two. So I've been doing space buns. I haven't done them in like a week, but I was doing them for a hot minute. So I picked up another Michael Myers one because he is my favorite in the entire world. And I picked up the It one because I've been using this one a lot because it's really neutral. And then this one was not a new release. It's their blood splatter one. I just thought it was really cute. Might end up grabbing another one whenever I make another purchase. And then this one right here says uh, Skater Ghoul. And it's like got the moon and then some skates on it. It's really cute. It's a little bit different of a fabric, but I really enjoy it. And if you saw at the beginning, I did put them in this crate, which you will see this crate unpainted in my next like haul clip. Um, but I've just been like painting these little crates and they're really cute. And um, Kenzie of Kenzie's Creations, um, I'm actually gonna be making her one and I think she might be putting scrunchies in it I own too many scrunchies to put <laughs> mine in here, but I feel like this would be really pretty for like taking a picture like I don't know. I think it's really cute. Um, but that is everything from Threads by Ty. I highly highly recommend their shop if you are a fan of scrunchies Love, okay I'm gonna go ahead and do this next one right here. This is a new to me shop and it is like a little already open because I had to show my boyfriend because these stickers, this purchase was inspired by him. He absolutely loves Deadpool like so much. I did purchase this off Etsy, but Jalen Paper Co. is now on their own website so make sure that you go there. And this is the journaling card that I got and she wrote like a cute little note, which is really sweet. Um, but yeah, he loves um, Deadpool so much. And I thought it'd be really cool to have Deadpool stickers to mark things that, I, like if I just hang out with him or if we watch Deadpool because we've watched it a couple times already in our month of dating. So probably gonna be watching it a lot. And I got a lot of, um, suggestions to try out this shop so I'm really excited for it this is the freebie that I got the sticker is massive but these are like really pretty I'm not sure if this shop um her name is Jessica I'm not sure if she draws everything but it's really cute so I did pick up all three sizes of the Deadpool stickers just because like these ones I probably won't get a lot of use out of, but they'd be cute in a planner setup or I could like give one of these stickers to him, but they're just so cute and the activities repeat. So there's Deadpool hugging a unicorn, coloring, and it looks like he's coloring someone when he's beating up, watching a movie, making a heart. He's got his swords. This one's just like kind of cute, I don't know, um, with a gun to a teddy bear. The uh, rubber duck and then on the toilet, and I showed these to my boyfriend and he was like, he was like, oh, I like all of them except like that one and 
that one I don't know and he was like basically all of the lovey ones and he was like messing around but it was really funny this one reminds me of him so much I don't know why um, but those are the big ones that's the medium size this is the small size and then the tiny size I think these would be good if you wanted to like put this over a full box like this is full box size this is probably half box and this is like a little thing quarter box size yeah I don't know I just felt like I had to do that and then I did pick up a couple other sheets from their shop um or from Jessica's shop so these are the I don't have an invoice for this but it is one of her characters in a car and she's got colorful hair and I always have colorful hair colorful hair so um, and I use a lot of car stickers especially now being in a kind of long-distance relationship so I grabbed those and then I also grabbed this like sampler of this girl and she has a couple different samplers a lot of different sheets of this girl but I thought this one was most applicable to me. I could find like the most amount of things in here to use. And I did get the small size in both this one and the other one. And in this one right here too. And this is her like Marvel one. Um, or maybe, no, it's not Marvel. It's just like superheroes because this is also, I think, Ghostbusters. Um, this is Coraline, Hocus Pocus, Star Wars, Pokemon that is Harley Quinn like there's just a lot going on here and I really liked it so those are the stickers that I grabbed from Jalen Paper Co. Next I have a pretty sizable order from Rose Colored Days sizable like with the amount of money that I spent um I don't know that it's like the biggest order in the world but I did spend a pretty penny on this and I'm really excited for it so Lauren does have these like what are these called? Cellos with the cute bows. And I'm going to save that because I have a lot of happy mail that I'm going to be sending out to people, which I'm really excited for. So I grabbed some overlay tapes as well as some regular stickers. I got this silver July uh, journaling card, which is really pretty. I don't know if I'm going to use that, but it's really cute. And then this is her business card. Just breathe. That's so pretty. I'm going to save that one for sure. And then these are, this is the order freebie. It is a like, it's kind of like the color of my hair, honestly, where it's like blue purple. And these are just some full box overlays. I did grab some underlays for her date covers because I already like own the underlays and I've used like a couple of them or no, I've only used one, I think. And I just put it like right on the page, but you can also buy different backgrounds to put underneath the date covers. I don't have any of them like by me, but I just grabbed these different like, this is the watercolor rainbow collection. I grabbed all of those. And then the neutral blush collection, I grabbed these three. I just think they're really pretty. Um, and they're a dollar each, but my friend Maddie does have a code. I can't remember if it's Maddie 15 or Maddie 10, but definitely check out her channel if you would like to see. And then I'm gonna go over the stickers first. So uh, I know that Maddie kind of like worked kind of with Lauren to create this. This is the LGBTQ plus awareness day. So her little like holiday sheets. Lauren is amazing. Let me just say that like she's an amazing person. Lauren is one of the first people that I met from the planner world. I met her when I was working at Erin Condren and she's just the sweetest human being ever. And she is also amazing in the fact that she has so many options in her shop and she has been coming out with a lot of different holiday sheets for all different like aspects and very specific ones. And I just like absolutely love it. So I did pick up everything in gold silver rose gold and her like sparkly hollow just because um those are like the four main foils that i use if i use hollow i use sparkly hollow with it and i am trying to get some new holiday sheets so i wanted to grab these um like i said i grabbed them in all those foils but you can get them in any foil because lauren does do her stuff in shop she has a ton of foil colors i'm so sorry that taco bell is like staying with me but the holidays on the sheet we have pride month happy pride lgb lgbt history month national coming out day anniversary of stonewall day of silence 
Orlando Memorial, Marriage Equality Day, Transden Transgender Day of Remembrance, Pride Parade, Pride Fest, and Spirit Day. Sorry, I cannot speak, but really, really happy about these. And then I'm so excited for these two to have some more, like some different holiday sheets. Like, I'm, I'm pumped. And I got these in all of the foils too. I just wanted to make sure. So, the, should I just read these? I guess I will. I know that Maddie and her haul, uh, she read these, but I will go ahead and read them. So we have Happy New Year, MLK Junior Day, Lunar New Year, Happy Valentine's Day, President's Day, Mardi Gras, International Woman's Day, Daylight Saving Begins, Happy St. Patrick's Day, Earth Day, Happy Easter, Happy Mother's Day, Memorial Day, Happy Father's Day, Happy Juneteenth, Happy Fourth of July, Labor Day, Indigenous Peoples Day, Daylight Saving Ends, Happy Halloween, Election Day, Independence Day. Let me just sidetrack. I love that there are holidays on here that are not on standard holiday sheets, like ones that I have had in the past. And also the fact that like, I don't know why, but it just bothers me so much when people say um, like, Happy Memorial Day. I don't know. I think just being from a military family and kind of like knowing what Memorial Day means just it rubs me the wrong way. So I'm glad that there's not like a happy there. I don't know if that like seems like odd for me to say, but I love the like diversity in here. Let's go ahead and continue. This is the page two. So you could buy page one, page two, or both of them together. I grabbed both of them. So we have Veterans Day, Happy Thanksgiving, Black Friday, Cyber Monday, Happy Holidays, Hanukkah Begins, Hanukkah Ends, Ramadan Begins, Ramadan Ends, Merry Christmas, Christmas Eve, New Year's Eve, My Birthday, Happy Anniversary times three, and six Happy Birthdays. So I'm super excited with these. Like I said, I have them in all of the foils, all the foils being gold, silver, rose gold, Maybe I got light gold. I'm not sure. I think I have my invoice right here. So I can tell you. Because like I said, she has a lot of options. So I got... Yeah, I got light gold. And then hollow sparkle, rose gold, and silver. So very, very excited for these. I'm really happy to have these in my collection. And then I also did pick up some of Lauren's overlay tapes. Um, I love her overlay tapes so much and these ones right here are the perforated 15 millimeter overlay tapes sc scallops and I love scallops I have like some scallop washi bits from Sadie stickers and I love them so much they're just so pretty and I buy the like all five option whenever I get the overlay tapes if I can from Lauren just because I don't know it's really easy and I'll go ahead and show you this this is on the rose gold I really wish she would add like a sparkly hollow to the like lineup but I'm not sure if that like is difficult to do but look at this y'all it's just so beautiful I'm so excited to have these in my collection like Y'all have no idea. I'm going to be using these a ton. And that is everything that I have from Rose Colored Days. I feel like I'm all over the place. I had a long day at work today. Next, uh, I'm going to say, like, I don't want to say the best for last, but the order that I'm most excited for and kind of the best for last. I don't know. I don't like choosing favorites, but, like, y'all y'all will see. Um, the next shop that I have is the Coffee Monsters Co., I love Helen. Helen is super sweet. And I'm really excited for this. Oh, they're so sweet over at Coffee Monsters Co. Okay, so we got a lot going on in here. And I am so excited to get into this that I'm like ripping the cello. Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to show my boyfriend these. Because this stuff is so cute. Okay. So, let's go ahead and get into the freebies that I got. So, let's do that. 
So this is the journaling card that I got, Plannerland. This is adorable. If this was a board game, I think I would die like Candyland, but Plannerland. And I got a note from Mama Tater. This is super cute. And you can collect the beans that are on the top of the sheets if you would like to. And then you can earn a like extra freebie. These are the free sheets that were thrown into my order. I almost always get sloth onesies thrown into here, so I have a ton of sheets of these, but I'm not mad because I love sloths and I love this so much. And then also, uh, Emoti Heads part, I think. Did I order these or? I don't remember if I ordered these or not. But they were like in the opposite side, which is where the freebies normally are, so. Um, these are the Modi Heads Part 8 and Part 7. I love these so much. Like, the heart ones. Oh, my gosh. But also, like, these are just... Oh, I love them so much. And I love, like, emoji heads or emoji heads for, like, anything that you don't have, like, a specific sticker for. This is the freebie that I have. So, there's this one with an umbrella. It looks like a character, but I'm not sure what character it is. The So Sweaty, which is me literally all the time. This ice cream one is adorable. And then this reminds me of Lost, kind of. If I remember, oh, if you heard that, that's Noel hacking. Um, if I remember to use this for Lost, that would be wonderful. And then I will go through these like smaller sheets. Girl, she's hacking up a storm back there. Um, I think I purchased this. I either purchased it or like obviously like it was a freebie, but I think I purchased it. Helen was doing a lot of um, like emojis with skin tone, hair colors, like basically like their own kind of character. And I love this idea so much. So cute. So I got this like sampler one and then I picked up Ginny and Chloe um, just to start out with, but I probably will end up like picking up like all of them and use them for marketing friends or anything. But basically, you get a like one in a dress, one holding a coffee, laptop, a donut and a cookie, some books, stickers, and a pencil. And I just grabbed these because I figured um, I relate to them a little bit. I mean, obviously not like perfectly, but that doesn't really matter. And I thought they would match spreads, so I grabbed those. And then I grabbed the holographic emoji heads. I think these are manufactured, but they're so cute and they're hollow so I had to grab them and I think this was maybe like if you bought this the money went towards something not positive but I feel like that's what that was then let's get into my order like the bigger sheets so I have these summer drink doodles which I love these so much if I was still marking coffee and my planner I would probably use these but I could use these for boba like really anything it's a drink doodle I love it the watermelon emojis. Oh, these are so cute. Helen comes out with the cutest stickers. Like, oh, can we just look at this one? So adorable. I'm, I'm dying. The s'mores and campfires, which, oh my god. And the friends. This is so cute. Oh my god. I'm so happy. I'm so glad that I like opened this today. The fruity summer treats. Again, super cute. If you hear any whining, Noelle is now right behind me. But she's gonna wait, cause I'm filming, baby. I'm sorry. You wait a little bit. Then the refreshing summer drinks emojis. Like I said, I'm like always warm, so this is applicable. I got emoji heads part nine. This was like the new release, and these. This emoji I use so often, so I had to get it. The rainbow banner emojis. This is on the pride sheet from last year, but I did already use that, so I wanted to grab that. I also grabbed the pride full boxes, which are super cute, and I definitely want to try and incorporate this in my next pride spread that I do. And then the blank flags, which I love this idea because you can use flags for a lot of different things, but especially for marking your own like pride flag because there are different ones. And I thought this was just like a really good idea, so. That is everything I have from Coffee Monsters Co. I love Helen and I highly recommend her shop. I'm going to let this girl out really quick and I want to get this up video up really fast so I'm not going to edit it out and I'm sorry. Come on home girl. Get your blue cheeks out here. Bye. Love you baby. Okay. Now I am so, look at this, I'm so excited for this. 
you guys have no idea. So, one of my friends, Hannah, Planet Hannah, on Instagram, opened up her own shop, and I'm just so proud of her. I know her release weekend went really, really well, and her release weekend was last weekend. Like, it literally just happened, and I already have this. Like, I'm shook. So, I am so excited for this. I just did a plan with me, and I saved a lot of spots for her scripts because I need... Oh, my God, you guys. You guys. <gasps> ah! I am so excited right now. Yes. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Let's see. So, she wrote my name all cutesy. Oh, and she wrote a little handwritten note. I love that. Hannah, you are the cutest. So, let me just talk about Hannah a little bit. Hannah's amazing. Her spreads are gorgeous. She always has the prettiest backgrounds too for her spreads. And she is a Taco Bell lover, just like myself. And we bond over that. So, she has so many good scripts for her shop. And she has, I believe, four different fonts. Not 100% sure if that's how many, but she does have different options and a ton of different ones. So let me just show you. I got Taco Bell, obviously, like I had to. Lost, which, fun fact, Hannah and her boyfriend are also watching Lost and they are like a couple episodes behind us and it's so funny. So we'll like message about it a little bit, but because I'm like a couple episodes ahead, I feel like a little hesitant towards like saying anything because I don't want to reveal what's going on. I got sad B um, because sometimes that's me and I think this would be really cool to mark instead of using like the in my feelings script. I got, um, it's so funny because I also got the in my feelings script, but you know, <laughs> I got FU anxiety because again, relatable and my feelings because that's me. That's a saying that I have and that I kind of brought into the sticker world a little bit. Um, Whataburger, which I had my first Whataburger like a week, I think a week or two ago and I'm a stan. So I'm really happy to have these. Michaels, which I've been going to Michaels a little bit more recently because I do have one right by my work. And also, I've been doing a lot more painting, so, you know, I got to. And then McDonald's, because it's a classic. <laughs> I love it. I am just so proud and happy for Hannah and for her shop. If you don't follow her already, definitely give her a follow on Instagram. And also, uh, check out her Etsy shop, because it's amazing. Like I said, she has also, like, Disney movies, um, a lot of, like, adulting scripts and stuff this was just my first order but i'm definitely gonna be placing a lot more and that is everything that i have for this haul let me just like kind of like put this stuff together like the flat stuff i'll put the deadpool stickers up here because they're really cute and like i said i do have another haul portion after this um so I'm just gonna like, you know, send you guys off there. But thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys are all doing well and I'll see you in a second. Hey everybody, so I'm back for a haul clip. Uh, I only have two shops and I do like quotations because like Michaels, do we consider that a shop? I don't know. But I have some stuff from Michaels that I got in today and then I also have an order from Sticky Essentials. The Michaels stuff is not really planner related like whatsoever besides a piece of paper. Um, but I thought I would share it just cause I don't know. I wanted to like haul these and, um, also just, I don't know. I thought this would like add something to it. So I'm going to start with the Michael stuff actually, just because it's so big. Um, this first thing that I have here, you see this right here. It's really, really pretty. It's this, um, sheet of paper. Um, it's a little bit more on the like thin side, but it's like holographic blue green oil shift with like this pattern. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but I thought this would be really good for, um, either one of my clouds. I did order the lilac one in the presale and I think those are starting to ship out. Um, I think this would be really pretty with that or with my, um, like the blue one that I have. So I picked that up. Um, that was $1.99. I have my receipt with me right now, so I just figured I would like share that. Um, the next thing I got, 
a lot of this is like the rest of this is like painting related because I do really like painting and I've been getting more into it so I bought this and this was $8.99 which is a really good deal the I've used this like specific type of brush before like the craft smart these bristle brushes there's other ones that are more like stiff and kind of scratchy which are good for like different textures but these ones are like really really good for overall painting i do paint with acrylics and um i like to buy these like value packs for most of my brushes and then as you'll see in a second i buy individual brushes for um certain things like detail brushes um just because like with these like they're pretty standard um, sometimes the hairs will fall out just because they are like a little bit cheaper, but you can easily pick those off. So this comes with 50 brushes and there's a lot in here and I'm really excited for it. They're all on the smaller side, which is good because, um, I normally need smaller brushes and not so much big ones. So I do have some big brushes as well. So there's that. Then I have these two mason jars. These ones are, does it say how much these one? These were $1.99. I think these are pints. They're 16 ounces. Um, I'm doing a lot of crafting with mason jars being like cutesy for like my friend Becca and my boyfriend. <laughs> um, so I needed this medium size because I have little baby ones and I have massive ones, but I didn't have any of the like regular size ones. So I picked up two of those from there. And then... I am going to save these for last. Uh, these little crates, you guys. Look at how cute these are. Um, I bought two of them when I went to Michael's with my friend Becca. And she was like, what are you going to do with those? And I was like, I have no idea. But, like, they inspire me. So I started painting the other two. And one of them I'm going to put, like, self-affirmations in. And, like, little cards and, like, flip through it. It's going to be really cute. Um, but I thought these would be really cute for actually, like, gifts or something. Um, my boyfriend's mom loves, like, inspirational quotes, so I might, like, make one of them for her. But they are only, uh, a dollar, like, 99 cents. So, I picked those up because I was inspired. Um, next I have two paint colors. Um, my paint collection is growing again, which is really exciting because when I moved, the last time I did donate all of it because... Uh, I didn't have a lot of time before to paint. I wasn't making a lot of time. I was working a lot more than I'm working now. So now I have more free time and I'm definitely very inspired. So I just picked up two paints this time, which is very small for me. Normally I pick up like 10 shades because I, I know it's kind of weird. I know all the shades that I have. Um, and I realized that I was lacking like a dark green and a like wine color. So I picked these two up. And these were 79 cents each. With acrylic paints, I feel like you don't have to buy the expensive ones. Like Craftsmart and Folk Art are really good. If you want specialty, I know Folk Art has some different finishes and stuff. Um, but like Martha Stewart paint is like close to like three bottles for like three dollars for a bottle around this size. And I think that's just kind of kind of whack. I don't see the difference in it. So yeah, I got those two colors to add to my collection. Then see these next things are new to me so I've never used paint pens before but I've been watching a lot of TikToks and TikTok knows like things about you that you don't tell it and I get a lot of like painting videos and I like to do some like details and stuff and I'll normally do them in white and black to like accent and um I did buy um, which you'll see next. They're my last two things for Michaels. I bought some really, really fine point detail brushes, but I wanted to try these out um, just to see if they like work because it's pretty nifty, pretty handy to not have to like dip your brush in something. So I'm very intrigued and interested to try these. These were both $3.99 for like the two pack of the black and the white. They have a bunch of different colors. These ones look like the thinnest ones that they had. So I got those ones and then these two brushes so I honestly don't even know if you guys like care about this I feel like I should have done this last because like I don't know if we enjoy this but um, I picked up these two brushes this one is a Princeton brush it is a 5-0 
level two. It's a petite round brush. And I don't know if you can see, it's just like super, super tiny. And this does feel like really, really good quality. And it doesn't feel like, like the bristles are stiff together, but still flexible. So I'm really, really excited for that. And the handle's really nice on this. And then this one is even tinier. This one is a, what is this brand? Spotter. Oh, I'm not even going to try that. Um, I think it might just be Spotter. It's a 20-0 level 2. And I will take this off if I can. If not, then that's just showing you guys how weak I am. I got it. Cool. <laughs> okay, so this one looks like this. I'll show you these, like, compared. So you can see it's just, like, even tinier. And I'm, like, really excited. This one, the bristles... Like, there's like one hair right here that's kind of like haywire, but I feel like once you get some paint on it, it'll like come together. But I'm like super excited for these and definitely like nerding out over paint brushes right now. So that's everything that I got from Michaels. Really like not planner related, but I'm sorry. I did look at the planner stickers and stuff because I was looking for more river and ink stuff, but the Michaels I went to didn't have any in stock, so kind of sad but next I have two kits here from Sticky Essentials my girl Delilah she's one of my best friends and I'm gonna start with this one because it has the free in it I did order she has it as like a free thing you just have to click the listing the Black Lives Matter boxes and definitely wanted to grab these so this is what they look like be the change you want to see in the world and Black Lives Matter I really enjoy this. I feel like if you foiled at home, you might be able to foil this yourself. I don't do that, so, you know. But this kit is called Rise and Shine. I can't sing. And I was trying to sound like Kylie Jenner there, so, yeah. Um, so Delilah's Paper is a premium matte. I am not a premium matte girl, but I love Delilah, so I still go with it. And I... I'm starting to find pens that work with them. I've been using like the Pilot G2 and that works pretty well. I just noticed that like my Sharpie tends to like run out of ink when I'm using it on premium matte. So yeah, look at these full boxes. Those pancakes are beautiful. I love like the Ray Dunn. That's very Delilah. So <laughs> it's so cute. Um, and this is her new format. So you get two checklists, two weekly ombres, some headers, the weekend banner, and then icons. I love Delilah's format because you get so many boxes. She does have a box add-on, but even me being super extra, I don't feel the need to like purchase that. So you get these squared boxes, some third squared boxes, and then some half squared boxes. Then you have the rounded ones, some patterned labels and washi strips. Then your little things page, which has some little things with icons on it, and then some blank little things and some quarter boxes. You get six work labels, more labels, uh, habit trackers, some checklists, which I have been using these more recently for like writing down all the movies that my boyfriend and I watch, so those are really helpful. Flags, hexagons, checklists, a movie marquee. Oh my god, this is so pretty. The extra full box, some more labels, a full set of glitter headers comes in your kit and then all the deco and then another full box your bottom washi and these beautiful date covers so that is stunning a great anytime kit but I definitely get either like fall vibes or even like February vibes would be pretty 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 wow good job Emily good job and then y'all I had to get this kit this is so cute. I'm not going back to school, but I'm going to live through my friends that are using this for back to school. I mean, I want to go back to school eventually, so maybe I'll try and save this for them, but I cannot promise that because I love Monsters, Inc. so much. So look at how vibrant these colors are. Like, ooh. So let's look at these. We've got the Monster University, this like dorm scene. This is adorable. The backpack. This planner says, put that thing back where it came from. And then the other fashion girl, these are just so pretty. I love it. So I'm just gonna like run through this because we did just see the format. I love these colors so much. This is gonna look gorgeous with Sparkly Hollow. 
or with like a fun foil, but I'll probably just do Sparkly Hollow. Honestly, my planner is like 90% hollow and sparkly hollow. And I'm kind of living for that. And I feel like it's been like that for a little over a year now. And I'm very proud of it, honestly, because that's just my vibe. These are so cute. I love that scare student. <sighs> Adorable. This is so cute. So that is everything. Guys, I know this was a really short clip and that like only 2% of it was planner related, but I hope you guys enjoyed it and that you guys are all doing well and uh, yeah, peace out.